I'm a painter, but I also do installations. I don't think I ever thought of myself being anything else. I think what has stuck with me is just how important uh, physicality is and expressing physicality and just action. I like masculine energy and I like to do big paintings and be super aggressive and fierce about it. Not that a woman can't do that, but I'm just saying that's sort of what I reign on. Doing large scale pieces just feels right to me. I do a lot of like drawings and stuff like that and those are definitely small and more pent up, but when I'm like doing a painting, it has to be big. For my installation Stalker, I believe there were 48 individual pieces. It was nice to be able to have a show where people and collectors had the opportunity to buy something a bit smaller than my typical scale. I approached the project as sort of a submission to darkness in order to find a true light, in a sense. When you walk into Stalker, it's very bright. And then you look closely and you see elements of darkness and they all begin to unfold and, and connect. It's intuitive and it's, um, it's like not holding anything back. Using this sort of lighter lens to portray a darker subject matter is something that I incorporate into all my work. I'm naturally just like a lighter looking person, but then if someone sees my work and then meets me, they would never believe it at all. Pretty much everything I do in my work is driven or derived from my inner self, because that's the only way that I can feel like I'm really doing something that's real. And the best way I can contribute to my surroundings is by being the most honest and genuine as I can. Even if it's your insides, like your guts, all splattered on this piece, you put it out there and like people love it, great. If people hate it, just as great. Like as long as you get a reaction, as long as you get people to see it. I feel like it's a certain aesthetic where very certain people are attracted to it. My experience so far is that it's very genuine. So I'm pretty ecstatic for any person who ends up collecting one of my pieces. I could have stopped a million times and said, forget this, I'm sweating. I'm dying, <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> I don't wanna do this anymore, but actually that all contributed to the piece. I never stop 